I am from the United States and I had a spinal cord injury in uh, May of 2007, about six years ago. Um, I was diagnosed with a T8, thoracic 8 um, injury, which uh, turned out to be complete. And I am here in Panama trying to uh, use this, uh, stem cell treatment as one of my um, tools to improve my current situation. I did um, different types of physical therapy um, in the United States and um, over, over the first two years after my accident I did, um, I did a lot of physical therapy to hopefully improve the condition but there was minimal improvement from that. Well, I, um, my background is biochemistry so I did know a little bit about stem cells before even my accident. So as soon as I had my accident, I made at least started doing research um, regarding stem cells and opportunities and the, and the medical powers that they have to hopefully heal uh, neuro neurological conditions such as spinal cord injury and did research about that. The United States did not offer that so I looked outside and this institute came up to be one of the most recommended, most positive um, feedback and, and that's how I decided to come here. Everything in, in the clinic is excellent. Treat the patients very well. Very clean, you know, if there's pain, they take care of your pain and they do what they can to make your, your stay in the panel during the treatment as comfortable as possible. Well, since I was injured at thoracic A, T8 level, um, the doctors told me that I would never be standing, never be walking, um, all the muscles below the injury level would never function, never say 99.9% chance of never functioning again. However, um, I currently am using uh, braces to help um, stabilize my legs for walking. I can stand and with, with a walker or crutches and over a period of a few hours I can walk to over distances of one kilometer or further even. And, um, Overall health and um, stability, equilibrium, things of that have improved drastically as well. Another uh, additional improvement has to do with um, contractions of muscles below the injury, which would be, uh, for example, like hip flexor quadriceps or gluteo, they all have um, contractions, very minimal contractions, but having contractions below the injury level. Um, and additionally, a new, new development is um, actually below my injury, I'm having um, my legs and even my feet are, have begun to sweat, which before the stem cell treatment that was not happening. Sure, I'd love to show you um, me standing and if possible maybe I can take a little few steps or so just to show you. Okay. <laughs> Here I get them with yeah. For now I still cannot lock my knees so I have braces that I use to lock the lock the knees because the muscles of my quadriceps are not I'm not strong enough to hold my body, but once my knees are locked and I have my braces on me, I can stand.
my, uh, my equilibrium, I can actually stand without holding on to the walker. So, it's a little still, a uh, little shaky still, but we're yeah. having, having big improvements with that. And if we had more space, I could show you walking with, with crutches, but uh, for now, this is a pretty big achievement for me. Thank you. Um, I've done a lot of research and I've made major progress. I absolutely recommend talking to them, getting yourself comfortable, doing some research, and um, if you have the if they have the desire and the hope, then you should absolutely give it a try. It can it can hurt to to investigate, and hopefully you can see you here and you'll be standing soon as well. <laughs>